Z, you're looking good as new. Indeed. That mechanical mixologist is a miracle worker. <laughs> I must know, did you locate the key to Tannenor? Uh, it's complicated. But we'll find it. Monk told me what transpired while I was asleep. To think the Jedi Order is no more, that must have been dreadful for you. We have both been through so much, but we must persevere, Cal. After all, what else is there to do? That's right. You've got room for one more? I shall remain here, but if you need my counsel, I will be at the saloon. I am very fortunate to have met you, Cal Kestis. found something out there. Oh yeah, what do you got, another holocron? A Jedi, from the time of the High Republic, somehow preserved him back to Dagon Gera. I freed him. What happened? He attacked me, escaped with the Bedlam Raiders. He's who they've been looking for. Says the Jedi betrayed him and turned to the dark side. Are you okay, kid? Tantalor. It's real, Grease. It's hidden somewhere in the Abyss. Oh, that's impossible. The Abyss eats any ship that gets too close. The Republic found a way through hundreds of years ago. That's why they built that array in the forest. A hidden world that nobody has been able to reach for centuries. If you figured out how to cross the Abyss, you could just disappear. Completely. No Bedlam Raiders. No Bounty Hunters. No Galactic Empire. I'm just spitballing here, but that does sound like a place that someone could call home. Yeah. Yeah, it could be a home. Get your feet down. Uh, all right, I'm going back to the cantina. You know, Grease, we could use a real pilot. I don't know. I mean, you're doing okay on your own. I mean, you could clean the Patoli weave every now and then. We don't know the Mantis like you do. Nobody does. Oh, Cal, I'm... I'm sorry. My best days are behind me. I, I can't even hold my card steady. I know things are different from how they used to be, but... Well, I'm not sure I could do this without you. Is that really how you feel? It is. Well, I mean, I guess I could have Monk keep his eye on the saloon. Greasy money. <laughs> <All right. laughs> you in? I mean, there's not going to be much in the way of credits. Cal, this is better than any score. Imagine, no more looking over your shoulder. A safe place for us, for the ones we love. If anyone knows about a lost Jedi world, it's here. Jedi! <laughs> It's about time you paid that lady a visit. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna make us some food before we go. Never been to Jeddah. We headed to the city? Nah, last I heard, Seer was holed up in the desert with some weird hermits called anchorites. <laughs> I just wish he'd pick a more lively cult. We're getting a signal from Jeddah. That's Seer. I sent word ahead that we'd be visiting. Let me put it up on the hollow projector. I got it. Well? They give me the creeps. I wonder what kind of weirdo she's gonna send to meet you. And the Empire's there too. Not the welcome I was hoping for. <laughs> Here we go. Come on. Let's go. 
Watching me? Like old times. Surprised to see me. I thought they'd send someone a bit more, uh, unfamiliar. I would not be so quick to judge, Calcastus. Much has changed since we last saw each other. I can see that. Come, my speeder is this way. Your land speeder? Stormtroopers found it. Then we will take care of them. And it looks like they found us too. You ready? I'll follow your lead. That's a first. Speeder. Even if the storm subsided, Seer is too far to reach on foot. Nice. What are you thinking? You might be able to hitch a ride. All right. Follow me. The way is blocked. Are you trying to kill me? Sorry, I thought... It's all right, Cal. Stand back. I will fix this. What are you doing? Restoring the pattern you threw into chaos. Incredible. That looked exhausting. You need a break? The storm's... <clears throat>
Round up. I've got him. Up there. I think that sword makes you special, Jedi. There's nothing here. Oh, 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 oh. Spamel saved us. So we can forgive it for leaving us to die. Agreed. Okay. Should be set for the night. Sit. Tell me what adventures you and BD have had since we last saw each other. All right. Same as always. Fighting the Empire, helping out where we can, not staying in one place too long. And, um... I think we might have found something special. A place where the Empire can't find us. But it would mean leaving the fight. And well, the fight is all I know. Cal. Look into the fire. It will warm you. Keep you company on dark, lonesome nights, yes? But left unchecked, it will consume everything in its path until there is only ash. But on a cold night, like tonight, a warm fire is perfect. And the company is not so bad either. I missed you, Marin. And I you. I had to leave, Cal, in order to see the galaxy on my own terms. What'd you find? Myself. Reflected in all the places and people I encountered. Dathomir will always be my home, but... It does not need to define me.
good to see you again. Master Cordova. It's an honor. I... I never thought I'd meet you in person. The honor is mine, Cal. Sears told me everything. You have demonstrated great bravery and wisdom in the face of overwhelming adversity. You chose well. Well, I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> the Empire has claimed the ruins. You'll have to find another rendezvous point. Unfortunate. But at least the storm covered your tracks. Come. Come, let me escort you inside. Master Cordova, did you find the Zepho? Only faint traces of their passage, heading deep into the unknown regions. Sorry to hear that. As it goes. Ultimately, that failure inspired me to seek out other Jedi survivors. That search led me back to my old apprentice. We mustn't keep Sio waiting. How have you been faring, Cal? That doesn't sound good. I've had a few scrapes, but I'm still breathing. And I'm glad for it. I heard some news about a Jedi terrorist on Coruscant not long ago. You were on Coruscant? Well, the Mantis looks like it's seen better days. We should see the other guys. Space is well hidden. Yes, so the Empire's presence has grown these past years. They are much too strong to fight directly, but we do what we can. Just keep trying. It's not like Brother Armai has to break contact. Cal Kestis. Welcome to Jetta. I knew the storm wouldn't deter you. You're rebuilding the temple archives. Yeah, we're trying. As long as this knowledge remains, the legacy of the Jedi survives. It's incredible. Mm -hmm. But something tells me there's more to this than just hollow books. Yes. We're a part of a network, known as the Hidden Path. We provide safe passage and new identities to those who have been persecuted by the Empire. Hunted by the Empire, like... like Jedi survivors? Very few of us remain. But yes, and Force sensitives, and those who help them. Why didn't you tell me? <laughs> you never asked. Besides, I hear you've been busy making yourself the Empire's most wanted. I wanted to prove to the galaxy that the Empire isn't invulnerable. That you can resist. That you have to fight if things are gonna get better. But then they just listen to the propaganda and they pretend they're free anyways. Hmm. Yeah. Chose a hard path. And it hasn't made a difference. Well, while the Empire's trained its eyes on you, we've been able to build the network, find allies, and save lives. When you left, you'd just given up. I was wrong. Cal, you were just a child when they sent you off to war. You know, there was a time when I remember that the Jedi were more than just weapons. But we both have our roles to play in this struggle. But that's why I'm here. Seer. Well, you get a load of this! Hey, Seer. You can't say it ain't short of personality, <laughs> but 
kind of creepy, though. <laughs> well, it's good to see you two agree. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh, hello, uh, Beanie. OK, OK, OK. <laughs> so how was your time in the desert? The storm covered our tracks, but the Empire destroyed one of your speeders. It's a small price to pay for everybody's safe arrival. And who's this? This is Bodokuna. He is a friend. It's so nice to finally meet you. Uh, it's hunk of trouble. <laughs> hey, we're all together. <laughs> yes. Now, what brings you all to Jeddah? We're searching for a lost planet. Tantalor, you ever heard of it? It's on the other side of a deadly nebula called the Kobo Abyss. Well, our archives are far from complete, but I'm sure Master Cordo was up to the task. With pleasure. The trouble is, we're not the only ones looking for this place. I knew this was sounding too easy. The guy's name is Dagon Gera. He was a Jedi. Now he leads a band of raiders on the Outer Rim. There's an old temple there. Dagon intends to reclaim it. A Jedi temple out of the reach of the Empire could mean that there's information there that we don't have in the archive. I believe I have something. <laughs> Oh, you're too kind, BD. <laughs> I'll start with the bad news. Oh, boy. This guy knows his audience. I found no information related to crossing the Kobo Abyss. However, I found two mentions of this Dagon Gera. He had a retreat on Kobo, and records show him frequently visiting a laboratory on its moon. Okay, we'll check him out. If you find anything, bring it to me. I am happy to assist further. Thank you. Both of you. You're welcome, Cal. I hope you find what you're searching for. May the Force be with you. And with you. I've had this since I started freelancing. It's gotten me out of some bad situations, and I figured it might do the same for you. It's Marin, right? Well, I could get another one, if you think you might want No need. Both. <laughs> yeah, you're, you're good. Okay. My master always frowned upon using blasters. You once said it wasn't the weapon that makes you a Jedi. It's us against the galaxy, Cal. We've got to use every advantage we can find against the Empire. Thanks, Bo. Places in ruins. Bounty hunter. Axiom Brew tracked us down. Been waiting for you. Scuffer picked up your trail outside the outpost. Cal. 
Sounds like you've been watching us. Oh, we've all been watching, Cal. Not every newcomer introduces themselves by taking down one of Ravis's boys, which, by the way, nice touch. Love a big entrance. Thanks. So what do you want? <sighs> what I want, Cal, is to reward you for every one of these that you take down. Not the only one who came to Kobo for a little peace and quiet. Take these off, bounty hunters, and I'll trade you something nice. So he was Hexian Brute. More bound to be on the way. Exactly. Lucky for you. I've got eyes and ears about. Stop by the saloon. No. Help you get a jump on those hunters. All right. I'll think it over. Bad feeling? Yeah, me too. I won't let you get enough. You have not seen the true extent of my powers. Welcome back. Hey. The Imperial labor camp on Maza. The garrison's half empty. We can strike before reinforcements arrive. Sounds promising, but Marin and Grease haven't made it back to the ship yet. Well, as soon as they do, I'll scout ahead and they can rest on the Mantis. You know they'll never allow themselves to rest if you're in danger. You never give up. And that's what inspires all of us. But you have to remember that where you lead, they will follow. I know I've been pushing recently, but ever since Grease what got hurt... What happened to Grease is not your fault. But ever since then, you've been reckless. 
keep worrying about something bad happening to one of you. It's good to acknowledge your fear, but don't let it determine your path. Focus on the moment. Choose your direction and act with certainty. And trust that whatever the odds, you'll pull through. Cal, trust yourself. Trust in the Force. Exactly. Everyone, this way. Hurry! Are you coming with us? I must remain here a little longer. Go now, there is no time. I will seal the passage behind you. May the Force be with you all. Junda sent me. Master Junda, you use the force, you're Cal Kestis. It's time to go. The Empire's closing in. Yes, which is why this must make it back to Master Junda. These contact codes cannot fall into the hands of the Empire.
trust me? Of course. What are you up to? No time to explain. Do you trust me? Yes. Was that for luck? No. For me. How did you do that?